Hi friends, welcome to Unique Cat Design. I hope all are doing good and safe from COVID. This COVID pandemic is very bad. In this video, I will tell you how to stretch a hatch in AutoCAD. It is a very small setting, but it will make a big difference in our workflow. Please stay with me till the end. We are creating a multiple hatches in our workflow. Sometime if you go for a stretch the hatch, it won't stretch with their boundary like this. Why this is happening? Because this is a non-associative hatch. This is an associative hatch. I will show you how to create those associative and non-associative hatch now. I will delete these two now. I will select hatch command. After selecting the hatch command, immediately the hatch creation tab will pop up on our ribbon. Here, at the option tab, we are having associative boundaries option. If you select this and then create an hatch and click enter to exit the command. Now, this is an associative hatch. This hatch will stretch with the boundary like this. I will go for a hatch command again. Now I will unselect this associative and I will create the hatch here and I will stretch this hatch. Now the boundary is stretching but hatch is not stretching here. So this is the difference between associative and non-associative hatches. And you can also use a system variable to change this. Go for hatch pattern associate and hp ass oc and click enter now change this variable to one after changing this if you create an hatch all the hatch will be associative hatch if you don't want this change the system variable to zero now onwards if you create an hatch it will be an unassociative hatch Thank you for watching till the end. Still you are not subscribed my channel. Please subscribe the channel and don't forget to click on bell icon to get the best information about AutoCAD. Thank you for watching. Take care. Bye bye.